YouTube. It is Sunday and I don't even know the date. I'm not even gonna try to know the date because it's, hold on, 17, 8, I guess it's 19. Uh, I am Sam's kids. Kids are at my, grand, my mother's house, their grandmother's house. I am with the husband who has forgotten something once again. Uh, and we are gonna go watch the playoff game at a bar. <laughs> um, yeah, so this should be very fun. Uh, I will show you what I'm wearing, just like a sweatshirt. Um, some jeans, I think these are J brand, and my workout Adidas sneakers. So just super chill, super fun, maybe we'll go out for date night tonight, we'll see, because tomorrow is Martin Luther King, so no one is working, and here comes the hubs. So, yay! Hey YouTube, it is Tuesday, January the 21st. Hope all of you are well. Um, got a few people in my last video saying, I miss your long videos. So here I am attempting my long videos again. <laughs> um, got kind of lazy there and then didn't really have a lot to talk about, wasn't buying stuff. Uh, so here's a question. Um, or maybe on those days I don't feel, like I don't have anything to talk about, which I don't know. I do have a lot to talk about, but don't want to talk about it here because I don't know if anyone wants to hear me talk. <laughs> but anyway, uh, for the days that I don't have anything to talk about, let me know in the comments uh, below on this video and future videos what you want me to talk about. What's going on in the world? Opinions, you know, people have, everyone has their own opinion of stuff. I have been opinions on things, but I don't share them most of the time because who cares? <laughs> it's my opinion. But some things might be worth chatting over and discussing it and having little uh, debates about. So let me know. Um, it'll give me some fuel for these videos. Um, yeah, so as you guys know, too, next month I will be out of this location and into another one. I hope I don't sit next to a chewer. At the moment, I have been sitting by myself for years, for like years, <laughs> years. And now we're going into those open settings where it's, you know, everyone's like right here. And I swear if I get a chewer, an open mouth chewer, a stinky cologne wearer, uh, talking on the phone loud person, I, I'm gonna have to say something because it's like, hello. And I, these offices, I don't know who comes up with this. No one wants to sit next to someone for eight hours a day. Just No one does. So I'm reading my um, Instagram things are popping up. But it's like, no one wants to be that close to someone for eight hours a day. You can't fart, you can't eat, you can't chew, you can't have fish. You know, you can't get on a phone call. God forbid you want to check your bank account, you know, or you want to just... <laughs> you're a little hungover that day and you just want to browse YouTube all day. God, you got to pretend like you're working now. But anyway... We'll see how it goes. Uh, yeah, so that's that. Haven't really been buying any clothes lately. I do have a couple of things I'm looking at. Um, um, but uh, nothing really to speak about. Um, yeah, so that's that. Today I am wearing these pants from Zara. And I've got to get myself, um, my belly down because these pants are so tight like the little, I know some of these people are like oh my gosh you don't look like you're gay I, I'm on my nose okay I'm on my nose where the fat is and where it wasn't and where it will not leave <laughs> so anyway Zara pants H&M tee and this old leather jacket from Arden B that, that rhymed and some Zara boots uh H um Pandora heart bracelet my coach Parker um yeah of Miss Coach Parker. There she is. She's wearing a little, she's wearing out a little bit here. You can see the leather here. It's um, kind of bending. But you know, I wear her. And one thing I do not like, and I wish, like, Coach, instead of using the microfiber, just charge me an extra couple hundred dollars and put suede in. Because this is starting to get on my nerves. Look at that. This bunching. And it's because it's microfiber. But anyway, she's still holding strong, and she's nice and fun to play with. 
uh, every so often I had to um, <laughs> kill the urge to wear some of my some one of my robes because those bags are just that good. Earrings are just I, didn't, I haven't changed them from last week. These little hoopy huggy hoops from Etsy and um, this little charm and a yeah. I haven't changed those from last week. Oh, and my Chanel necklace. So that is that. I will be talking to you tomorrow. Take care. Bye. Hey, YouTube. It is a Monday, January 27th, I believe, at a slightly different angle because there's boxes everywhere here. Hope you guys had a great weekend. I am looking quite tired. Um... I got dressed in the dark this morning and did my makeup in the dark and apparently didn't put on too much because I didn't want to put on too much because I was doing it in the dark because my husband was sleeping. But, um, oh well. The tide's gonna be the look today. I stayed up watching the Grammys mainly because I had to take my mind off of the death of Kobe Bryant and all of the other people on up that helicopter. I am not into basketball. Haven't been since the greats uh, of my time, aka Michael Jordan, um, I have stopped playing, but you know, of course you hear Kobe's name and so forth and so on through the years and to hear that he died with his daughter. And then this morning, um, a coach, baseball coach, his daughter and his wife, another base basketball uh, um, player and her mother, uh, and obviously the person flying the helicopter, uh, it's, it's horrible. It's horrible. I mean, tragic. And I think that's why it's hitting because, you know, you wake up and you don't know if you're ever coming home. So you're faced with your own mortality. But, um, it's just, I don't, I can't imagine what his wife is going through. Anyway, I had to, um, I watched the Grammys, which I never do because I don't know any of these people. I don't listen to the radio anymore. Uh, I am of the belief that music has died. These people never stay around. No one has any greatest hits anymore. They're just little pop songs, uh, little songs that just don't stand the test of time. So I refuse to invest my energy or time in these people. But anyway, I was like, I gotta watch something because I, I can't be watching the coverage of, um, of this. So I did. <laughs> And I stand strong in my opinion. I'm like, who are these people? Who who are these people? Who are these people? Why is everyone so extra? Why is everyone doing everything other than singing? What's with these outfits? I'm sorry. I maybe I am old. I am old. I'm getting old because I'm just like Outcast did that next. Prince did that next. <laughs> anyway, I had a couple. I had a bottle of champagne next to me. And so I was doing my uh, little routine on Instagram because I was just like, I, oh, whoa, whoa. I, I don't know who these people are. I, I don't know who these people are. Well, I, I don't care who these people are. I'm so tired of seeing ass. I, my daughter is sitting there. I'm tired of seeing ass cheeks, hole dancing, pole dancing. You, we go so far into me too and and her and movements and this and that but your ass is still up on stage jiggling i don't get the correlation don't come and tell me it's art it's not fucking art it's your ass everyone has an ass ground breaking i don't need to see it my kid doesn't need to see it jiggling like i just don't get it when does showing your ass represent being a strong female why? Who came up with that? Taking off clothes means I'm liberated. No, it doesn't. It means you're loose. You're jiggling in the wind. That's all it means. That's all it means. It means you have no morals. It means you have no standards for yourself. It means that everyone in it, whoever, can see your your little privates. And we're supposed to be teaching our kids not to show our privates and this and that. It's hypocrisy. I'm sorry to go off on a tangent, but I am so sick of this world. I am so sick of this world. And people in society telling me that this is okay, things are okay, and, and you have to be all this and that. No, I don't fucking have to be any sort of way. Excuse me for cursing. I hope kids don't watch this because I'm just so irritated at human. Human. Irritated. This is why I don't watch the Grammys or these kind of shows because it's just, I'm just sitting in there like, you have no talent, 
So all you do is bring a bunch of girls on stage in lingerie, shaking your ass. That's, that's, that's the extent of your talent. So, you know, you've just, you're, you're bringing the movement back 8,000 years because, anyway, that's that guys. See, this is why I don't come on here anymore and talk because I have nothing good to say. I have nothing good to say. Um, uh, my commentary will might might seem old and outdated, and oh, you're prude, and it's not that serious. It is that serious. If it's not that serious, what is serious anymore? What today is considered serious, sacred? I'd like to know. Everything goes because if you don't stand for something, you're gonna fall for every goddamn thing. Sorry, sorry. I I. Uh. I'm gonna let it go. As it, and, uh, Disney's another thing I just heard. I don't know. It's a, we're not even gonna get into that. But anyway, guys, the outfit today. I am wearing a, my H and M cozy cozy sweater because it's, it's not cold outside, but it's a little raw, and I'm kind of getting tired of the cold. And we haven't even had a bad winter, so I should just stop being tired. H and M cords. My coach sneakers, J. Crew coat, and my rogue. Yeah. Um. Yeah. So that's about it. Um. I just put on this Revlon thing that I've had for years. I really should get rid of. I'm pretty sure I'm poisoning myself. Um. It's called Forever HD. Forever Ultra HD. Yeah. I'm. I'm becoming jaded in my old age. I think. Um, and I just have nothing good to say. What do you guys think? Hmm? I mean, you guys are awesome. I like talking to you guys, but I'm afraid I'm like gonna scare you guys away because my my opinions just aren't the norm. They're not the norm. Um, and no one wants to hear opinions because everyone's got one. So it's like, who cares? Amy, who cares? Just show them what you bought. <laughs> I'm in a mood and I have been in a mood for a very long time because I'm a bit disappointed with humanity. I really am, and what I'm leaving my children to. And how do I raise these children with the morals and ideals that I grew up with when the whole world seems to be against that? I, you know, it's like, anyway, hopefully I'll be in a better mood tomorrow. We'll see. I will talk to you guys tomorrow. Take care. Bye. Good morning, uh, YouTube. It is... Uh, what is this, Tuesday, uh, I believe it's the 28th. My hair is a bit crazy at the moment. I just did it, I need to brush it some more. But um, yeah, the 28th, getting ready for work, about to run out the door, I'm gonna finish getting dressed. Um, but uh, still the news about Kobe Bryant and the others who died, um, really, really sad. I uh, heard it on Sunday. We had just come back from outside. My husband's like, oh my God, Kobe Bryant's dead. And then, you know, of course, all the news came out. His daughter and... And then yesterday, the the other people who died, the, the father, the mom and the daughter, the, mo the other mother and her daughter, and then the, the, the woman coach and then the pilot. It's just horrible. And it's just been in a bad mood. I think it's just... You know, it brings to light your own mortality and how, you know, they woke up that morning, they didn't think they were, weren't were going to come back, you know? So I've been kind of a funky mood. <laughs> um, but my heart goes out to all of them. All of them. I can only imagine the pure terror that they felt at that moment that they knew they were going to die. But, you know, it's just really sad. Um, yeah, so I'm going to show you guys what I'm going to wear. First, I gotta pick out a lippy. I really need to refresh my lip drawer because some of these are like, they're done. <laughs> I mean, they're still there, but they're done. Um, let's see here. You know what I think I'm gonna do a combination of these, like my two favorite combos from Lime Crime. And they have some new stuff. I think this one is Teddy Bear and this one is Cashmere. So, let's Go put those on. And there is the lippy on. I've been going a little light on the eyeshadow. I don't think I like it. <laughs> I need to go a little darker. 
I still look tired. If I did anything to my face, it would be to do something about this here. You see the creasing? I won't, but that's like the only thing. But yeah, so Lime Crime Teddy Bear first, and then a little bit of cashmere on top on the eyeballs. I've got my MAC palette. Uh, I think this is uninterrupted in the crease. This is, um, God, I don't know what that is, but it's an orange. I love any orange shade in the upper crease. And then this, a darker shade on the lid. I mean, you guys know MAC colors. These are so old too. Got my, uh, I think I'm gonna stick with my, um, what is this rogue? My goodness, I can't talk think today. Uh, I want to say Blackberry, <laughs> my Oxblood Rogue. I gotta grab my work phone. I keep always forget to charge this. It's so annoying. I love it, but it's so annoying when I forget to charge it. I just picked up another one of these stackers yesterday from the container store. They were on sale for $12. I love them. So my jewelry is a little bit more um, organized. So I got all my completed Pandora bracelets in that one my projects in that one. And I actually may pick up oh, one more of these. And then in the top one, my beloved Chanel necklace, some Dior earrings, some hoops, my Citrine necklace, and my rings. So just trying to get my, you know what? I'm gonna also move my Hermes bracelet because I don't want it in it didn't fit. I'm gonna, I'll put it down here. And here comes the case. I'll put it in here because it's been to the elements too much. Okay. All right. I think I'm just gonna throw on my J. Crew blazer on top. All right. So today I am just wearing this leopard um, tie top, which I never tie. I can't be bothered. <laughs> From uh, J. Crew. Some H&M pants, excuse the frickin' mirror. I can never keep it clean with these children. Um, I have been into wearing sneakers lately. I think I may be changing over to sneakers. I mean, I do have shoes at the, under my desk, but uh, these sneakers are just, they're godsend. I gotta do my rug. Um, Coach sneakers, uh, J. Crew blazer, and I just threw on my Chanel. Uh, necklace, Zara coat, uh, Louis Vuitton scarf, and my rogue. All right, guys, let me run. I will be talking to you tomorrow. Take care. Bye. <laughs>
I can never get the date right. You guys know that. Um, about to head out. Just notice I have clothes hanging. Some clothes that I don't, I don't dry, I hang on the door. Don't judge me. Anyway, um, because I've run out of room in my laundry room. I hope everyone is well. Uh, let's do a quick outfit of the day because I have to jet. Um, not, I didn't put on any lipstick as of yet. Maybe when I get to work, I can't be bothered. But quick jewelry is my uh, Chanel necklace turned around because it's like two sides. You can wear it on two sides. I rarely wear it on this side because I love this side so much. But I happened to put it on wrong and I don't have time to change it. Pandora heart bracelet. I'm gonna do my nails. Pandora heart ring. Uh, dress, a silk dress from All Saints and with my sneakers because mama's all about comfort these days. These are my uh, Nike Cortez in mauve. I'll change when I get to work. And my dreamer. Forgot to clean my mirror. No, my macage big coat because it's cold outside. Good morning, YouTube. Oh, you see like my 10 chins. <laughs> anyway, it is Thursday, January the 30th. I'm on my way to work late as usual late and there's frost in the car and I have to drive my husband's car and I've been sitting here for a few days and I need to charge it. Oh gosh, I'm charge it. I need to warm it up. I'm losing my mind. Oh, I gotta climb into this thing with a skirt. That sounds rough. Okay, we lock our doors as soon as we get in the car because nowhere is safe. Anyway, yeah, um, it is 7.16, Thursday morning. Can't wait to get this day over with because today is my Friday. Well, I work from home on Fridays, but you know. So quickly to what I am wearing. Um, what is this, a turtleneck from H&M, a skirt from Zara, Zara Mule, uh, Zara Oxfords, and uh, my Chanel long necklace and my Chloe bag. Yeah, that is what the outfit consists of today. Uh, next year, I have to work on some shoes. I know I have a lot of shoes, but I have shoes that I don't wear anymore. I gotta get rid of those and revamp my shoe cl collection. I am completely into sneakers now. I need to get myself some black sneakers, all black, all colors, so I can just wear them now because mama needs to be comfortable, okay? I need to be comfortable and I, I love comfort now because I'm old <laughs> and that's okay. My feet have uh, paid their dues. Anyway, let me get out of here. Can you see? <sighs> Although I can't complain because this year, this winter hasn't been so bad. So yeah, I'm gonna show you two pairs of sneakers hopefully that I can pick up next week. I love them. I have a pair already and they are most comfortable. So I wanna go and grab these two colors. So that's it guys, I hope you have a great weekend and I will be talking to you soon, take care.